Hey guys and welcome to a pre-vlogmas vlog. So I thought I would vlog for the next couple of days. I'm going to do a two day vlog because I've come to Clevedon House with Pandora and we're going to have a very festive weekend. So I thought I would bring you along with me. So first of all this morning we've got a wreath making class and some more festive activities. So let's go inside and get started. gift wrapping so we're learning all the tips of the trick for how to perfectly wrap a gift. Here's my finished result so I might do another mini video on this because I think it's really useful but the tips are folding your edges so they're super neat, double-sided sticky tape is an absolute must and I just learned a very sneaky tip on bow tying so stay tuned to find out how to tie the perfect bow. I'll also just take a moment to appreciate how beautiful this kitchen is. I'm gonna save this clip to give to a future builder in my dream house because I've got the subway tiles, I've got the duck egg flu aga. So we have been suited and booted with some lovely jewels, jackets and wellies and now we're going to take a nice brisk country walk through the grounds and we're going back to Clevedon House for a festive lunch. It's a little bit later now and we've had a delicious festive lunch and now we're back in Spring Cottage and we are doing our wreath making now. It's just so cosy in here, we've got a big fire in the background and this place is just absolutely stunning. I just love to spend Christmas somewhere this cosy. So let's see how the wreath looks. It's a little bit later on now and we've just finished doing our wreath making and I didn't really film too much of the wreath making because it was very dark by the time we got started but I'm pretty proud of my wreath so I'll show you in a second. Starting to feel very festive now that we've made our made our wreaths, done our wrapping so yes a really lovely festive morning um, and we've now just come to our rooms here in the main building of Clevedon House and this is my room so it's a very grand big living area behind me. I've got a desk, 
a little lounge area and then a beautiful big fireplace then you go through these doors and into my bedroom so it's just such a big beautiful old national trust house and i was really interested to find out about the history of this place but luckily um they've actually given us a book all about the history on our beds so i'm gonna have a little flick through that but pandora have also put a few other goodies on the bed so let's have a little look at what we've got oh such lovely treats we've got a fluffy hot water bottle there's a really beautiful blanket, some fluffy socks, perfect to go with my new wellies, which I'm not wearing. Um, let's see what's in here. It could be a mug or something. Let's have a look. Emma Bridgewater, yes. Let's see what's inside. Oh, that is absolutely adorable. Look at that personalised Emma Bridgewater mug. That is so pretty. And then this is the Tales of the Mistresses of Clevedon. Very interesting. And this box says hush on it, so I'm not sure what's in here. Let's have a look. Dun dun dun. Oh, what is it? Hush chocolate. Oh, it's chocolate. And then I think this might be a pair of socks or hand warmers. Don't really know, but they feel very soft. So I think we've got just over an hour to relax before dinner. I'm gonna take my makeup off and just do a little bit of work, I think. Relax in my beautiful room. I think there's a tea and coffee machine somewhere. I might make myself a cup of coffee. And then at half past seven, we're all meeting for dinner. Tuesday morning and I just had the best night's sleep in my ginormous bed here at Clevedon. We had such a good night last night. We all had a really lovely festive dinner downstairs in this beautiful dining room. I had beef wellington, I had a burrata and beetroot starter um, and then a delicious like pineapple parfait for dessert. So really really fabulous evening and we also did a secret Santa with Pandora gifts. I'm wearing a little Pandora dressing gown. It's just so adorable um, and Camilla who is just so lovely she chose or she was my secret Santa and she got me um, this absolutely beautiful necklace I'll show you a close-up of it um, and it's one of their new ones it's like a locket and you can choose what charms you put in it so she's chosen a little star like an angel and an angel wing which is good timing because it's a Victoria's Secret show coming soon so we're all getting really excited to see that um, but yeah it's just absolutely stunning I don't own much silver jewelry but she actually layers her jewelry like silver and golds so I'm gonna give that a try um I'm actually gonna pack my suitcase up now because I'll show you the view behind me in a second but basically I watched the sunrise over the main house and it was so stunning and I'm just desperate to go out there and take some photos so I'm gonna pack up so I don't need to come back up to the room go downstairs meet some of the girls for breakfast and then do some photos and I'm gonna carry on this vlog just for the rest of the day I think because I do have a pretty fun day planned which is staying here until about 11 then I'm going back to London um, and I'll just take you along with me for the rest of the day so time for a little update i'm afraid i didn't vlog too much this morning i've really been very bad i'm so sorry i promise vlogmas will not be like this um 
But we're back in London now, as you can probably see. Can't really see because the sun's in my face. Um, but yeah, back in London now. And I am about to go to Selfridges for a meeting. And also, I'm going to be picking out a pair of designer shoes for the party season. So I thought I would take you shopping with me. Um, I'm thinking maybe Gucci or Valentino, but who knows, feeling spendy. And um, yeah, then I'm just gonna head home. Luckily, I've only got my suitcase with me because the Pandora girls have kindly said they're gonna post the rest of the stuff back to me because I had wellies, I had bags, I had so much stuff. So I've just got my suitcase with me. So one meeting, a bit of shopping, and then it's back home for a busy afternoon of work. my fabulous shopping trip with collection I'm gonna show you the new collection collection in a second because it's very sparkly and festive and I'm also gonna show you what I picked up because it's rather fabulous um, I wasn't really planning on buying a pair of shoes today but I saw these ones and I've been wearing my Valentino rock studs a lot recently they're pretty much my only designer pair of shoes that I wear um, for like smart occasions so I thought I would splash out and get a different version or a different pair of shoes for you know glamorous evening occasions so I'll show you what I picked up. Feeling a little bit car sick actually because I was doing work on the bus, I was going I was going through my emails using my laptop on personal hotspot and oh my god I think a cat just jumped from a really high roof in front of the window. Either that or it was a very fat bird. I'm rambling because I feel car sick and don't know what to do with myself. Um, but yeah, I've just come home. I thought Charlie was going to be here, but he's not. He's obviously been to Doll, though, because there's some blogger mail here for me, including... I don't know what this is, but it's beautifully wrapped. Look how gorgeous that is. So I'm going to have a little flick through that. I've just put the kettle on. I'm going to make myself some pasta. I didn't really have lunch today, and I feel like breakfast was a million and million hours ago. Um, so yeah, let me quickly show you what I bought from Selfridges. Here they are. So this is my very first pair of Jean Vito Rossi shoes. I've heard amazing things about them. And as soon as I saw these, they're such my kind of color. And yeah, hopefully I'll be able to wear them a lot for evening do's and summer weddings. Cause as I'm sure you'll agree, they're a very versatile color. Let's just open it up. So I've got this little um, dust bag, which is really good for storage. And then, Dun, dun, dun! God, I can't get in. Here they are, all beautifully wrapped up. I'm just gonna get one out and show you properly. How beautiful are these? So they've got this Perspex side, which makes them fit really snugly to your feet and also makes them very, very comfortable because they just fit so well. Um, the back is like this beautiful blush suede, definitely my kind of color. And then the point is a rose gold leather, which is just, 
I can't even imagine a more perfect pair of shoes for me. I honestly wasn't really expecting to fall in love with these so much. I went in thinking maybe I'd get some Gucci boots, but came out with these, and a fairly good price for designer shoes as well. And I have heard from a lot of well-trusted sources that they're really comfortable, so I'm so excited to wear these. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below of my new little treat. So I also got introduced to the new Christmas collection, or some latest releases from collections. Let me show you. Oh, this colour, oh my god, I feel like it goes with the shoes. So perfect. This is this is a really good formula. So this is their two-step solar gel shine. Um, and this almost gives the effect of shellac because it really does give a very glossy shine and almost like a 3D colour on your nails. So I'm going to redo my nails with those later on this afternoon. Um, this is just a gorgeous eyeshadow palette. You guys have heard me raving about these in the past. This one is quite a cool tone one, and I feel like I'm gonna switch it up a little bit for Christmas this year. I normally go with golds and bronzes, but that's a really different color palette for me. And it's, because they're so affordable, it's a great way of trying out some new colors. Um, then their lip liners, which I didn't even know that they did, but they are scroll up as opposed to sharpening. So I feel like that's just gonna be so handy, and I adore that color, and they're so soft as well. Um, then we've got a retouch stick, this is like a lining concealer for under the eyes. These are just the most fabulous glitters, I tried them on the back of my hand during the meeting and they are so sparkly, I cannot wait to create some Christmas sparkly eyes with those. Oops. Then we've got some bold red lips, a couple of different formulas to try. I mean, everyone loves a red lip during the festive season, and these are just two really beautiful, flattering shades. Then we've got their creamy concealer, which is the lasting perfection, and as far as drugstore concealers go, I would say this is definitely in my top three, if not my favourite. And finally, their kind of chubby stick uh, shimmer highlighter, which I've not tried yet, so really looking forward to giving this one a go. So that's my fabulous new pair of shoes. What a lovely way to round off a very fabulous couple of days. So I actually think I'm gonna end this vlog here because I'm just gonna do some vlog photos right now at home. I've got to pack for Zurich tomorrow, which you guys are going to be seeing in Vlogmas, which is starting in like two days time. So please make sure you are subscribed. I'm now gonna try and edit and upload this video today. So today for me is Tuesday, the 20. 9th, so if you're seeing this on Tuesday, it means I got the job done. Um, if not, then this is just awkward, but yeah. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm signing off now. Please leave a comment with a purple heart if you got to the end, because I know this is going to be a, lo a long one. So purple heart if you made it to the end, and I'm so excited to vlogmas. Yay! See you soon. Bye!